I've been this new age for 41 minutes, and oh, 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 I want to know it all. I'll never know it all. Nobody could ever know anything. And is it so bad? Is it so bad to want to pine to know every conceivable fact, every little bit of stray knowledge that finds its way, squirming its way into your ear canal and into your brain? You have this great big dopamine hit, and you say to yourself, wow, wow. I still know nothing. I must know more. And so you read, 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 because you want to grow, grow, grow. And even though you will never know everything, there is no way that any human being walking on this earth can ever know everything. There used to be a time in human history when that was possible, but that was centuries ago, not now. But you try anyway, because human beings are just so, so hungry and voracious and curious, and you want to know this, and you want to know that. And sometimes the wrong bits of nuggets go into your skull, deposits themselves there. They're a bit like pop song lyrics. Why the fuck do I know every single fucking Spice Girls lyric? I don't fucking know. But for some reason, it settled into my craw, okay? Okay? Sue my fucking ass. The Spice Girls are irresistible, even now in 2023. And there shall be no disrespect of any of the Spice Girls on this feed. But I was talking about wanting to know it all. And how despite the fact that I surround myself with so many fucking books, many of which I've read, some of which I'll get to, some of which will never be read at all. That's my life. That's my quest. That's why my brain is so, well, two-way radio, right? Loquacious in speech, garrulous by TikTok, but absolutely voracious so that all of this information can go into my head and that if I need to go on some three-minute monologue, it will hopefully be at least a little bit interesting. A modicum. Hmm.